Renaissance Festival, baby! My name is Jeremy Charles, and I'm gonna be your traveling guide. The Renaissance Festival is by far one of my favorite festivals to go to in Arizona. It's the first weekend of February to usually the last weekend of March, and it goes on Saturdays and Sundays and President's Day. Now, Sunday, I think, is the best time to go. That's just my opinion. The festival is located in Gold Canyon, which is actually right next to the Superstition Mountains. And so the whole time you're there at the festival, you get this epic view of Superstition Mountain, and it's uh, absolutely beautiful. So my friends and I have been going to this festival every opening weekend. It's like been a tradition now. And the first thing you want to do when you get in there is grab a drink and something to eat and catch a show as soon as possible. The festival offers 14 different stages and live performances throughout the day that were absolutely amazing. They take people up on stage. Every show is different because they ad lib so much. The performances that these performers perform are perfect. Here's a little taste of these amazing shows. <laughs> After watching a show or two, another thing to do at the Renaissance Festival is to walk around, check out the shops, talk to the people, maybe buy something. My favorite shops to visit are definitely sword shops and armory shops, which I'll give a huge shout out to Rose and Thorn Armory, uh, right next to the Joust, where they'll, they'll suit you up in some armor and they'll give you a free beating. What is your shop name? <laughs> Rose and Thorn Armory. One, two, three. Beating, 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 God save the queen! God save the queen! So this is up to an inch thick, built for open so it was a large of steel. Ready? Ready. Woo! Huzzah! Hey! Oh! Nice job! That was pretty good! Oh, I can't yeah. shit. Put the balloon behind you. Yeah. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? <laughs> <laughs> Gladiator! I love your shoes. <laughs> Goodbye from the Renaissance Festival. I do have to wait till next year, but 100%, I want one so bad. Another thing to do is to get heckled by the tomato guy as you try to throw a tomato at his face. My buddy Castleberry went for it and nailed him right in the face. Let's go ahead and check that out. Soon, baby. <laughs> so as you're walking around this place, you'll find these different uh, shows, these random shows that you'll run into. Um, for example, the, uh, the bell guy. I love it. I know. Huh. Oh. So dramatic, it would suit you perfectly. Yes, the bells. <laughs> did you ever see Excalibur? I don't know if you did, but it was the story of King Arthur and the knights of the Round Table, and there was a priest named Merlin. <laughs> the Renaissance Fair has a petting zoo that you can go into that offers a bunch of 15th century. Um, kind of farm animals like uh, geese, chickens, they have uh, goats, they have these like little baby goats that were all stumbling around and all cute. 
And then the very last thing that you need to do is to go to the tournament in the arena, the joust, the sword fighting, sword fighting to the death, the brandishing of the turkey leg. Make sure you get a turkey leg and you brandish that thing at your champion, yelling and screaming and just, argh. that was more of a pirate. <laughs> yeah, so uh, let's go ahead and have a look at that. Here's my experience at the, uh, the old tournament at the end of the day. It's happening right now. The joust, the, the time, the action, turkey leg. Oh. 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 And that's the uh, that's the Arizona Renaissance Festival in a nutshell. I mean, every experience is different. You'll have a totally different experience than I did. Definitely need to check out uh, Dead Bob Show, Tortuga Twins, um, The Wet Winches. Those are definitely the shows to go see. They are not very uh, PC, so fair warning. Do not bring your kids to those shows. <laughs> but there are so many different shows performances, puns, uh, people watching, food, drinks. So many hidden gems you'll find throughout the place. You gotta come to the Renaissance Fair. It's only here until March, the end of March. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Jeremy Charles. Huzzah!